Happy Wednesday, everyone. The Halloween Eve, that is, is rainy, cloudy, spooky, just in general, a little on the windy side as well, and some higher elevations, seeing a lot of snow. We are going to add to that as we head into Halloween itself. But talking about our overall conditions, we're going to break it down essentially by the elements, and that's when you know there's a pretty decent system rolling on through the area with widespread moderate to heavy rainfall through at least Saturday. In terms of rainfall amounts, your Wednesday and your Friday showing the most overall rainfall, but Thursday plenty of showers throughout the course of the day for Halloween itself. Heavier snow once you get above 5,000 to 5,500 feet. That's what we're talking several inches to a foot two, maybe even three feet of snow, four, six to 7,000 feet and above. It's a lot of snow in a short amount of time, so do be aware of that. Check out tripcheck.com if you happen to be checking out or heading over some of those mountain passes. Lighter snow, we're still talking a few inches between 4,000 and 5,000 feet, which does include areas like the Siskiyou Summit, which could see a bit more than a dusting of snowfall over the next few days. Breezy to gusty winds, mainly on the coast in the Shasta Valley and east of the Cascades, but up and over the Cascades. Some areas where we're seeing some heavier snow, also seeing the those higher winds and also the beaches themselves because of the higher winds, low pressure moving on in and just overall active storminess. We do have high surf advisory, so beaches themselves could be on the hazardous side of things. Best to avoid them just in general for the coast. Speaking of the beaches, cloudy, windy, showery and potentially stormy weather. 40s for your lows, 50s for your highs with that high surf advisory through 5 a.m. Friday because of cloudy, windy conditions included in that and those larger breaking waves for the West Valley's a winter storm warning. Once you get above five 5,000 feet, but for most of us, showery weather. That'll continue tonight and a good part of tomorrow. Another round of heavier rainfall, especially to start out the day. Then by trick-or-treating time in the afternoon, trending mainly towards lighter showers. So a bit of an ease off in terms of the overall rainfall as you head later in the day, which is good news for the kids out there. East of the Cascades, cloudy, rainy, and then rain and snow as we go tonight into tomorrow. That mix of rain and snow showers continues for a good part of the day on Thursday. As we look at the seven-day forecast, rain, and then lighter showers as we head into your Thursday afternoon and evening. Friday, more rainfall. Showers continue Saturday and then at least a chance on Sunday. Even next week, showing a decent chance of shower activity for the time being, but it could trend either way. So we're going with a slight chance on Tuesday, which is showing the best overall potential. For the basin, rain and snow and at times mainly snow. Friday and Saturday morning, for example, also fairly windy the next few days. Northern California, windy, rainy, snowy conditions. That continues into the weekend. And out on the coast, rain in the forecast just about every day over the next seven. 